I'm back in Seattle. Just took a ferry from Bainbridge Island. I am about to meet up with my family and we're gonna have a little Seattle day. Mm -hmm. Oh, I don't wanna go to a chain. Oh, it's definitely a chain. Happy birthday! Good morning! Today is Tuesday and we stayed at our hotel in Seattle last night, clearly. And now today we have like a bunch of Seattle things that we're doing. We're gonna go to Hike Place to start it off. Let's do a little walk through. Then we're going to this thing called like the Festival of Trees at a hotel, which is gonna be really cute and Christmassy. Then we're doing an underground tour of Seattle, which will be really cool. And then we're just gonna kind of walk around, maybe do the Space Noodle because that didn't work out the other day. So it's gonna be really pretty. Also look at my view right now. Unreal. So pretty. And we even have a tiny little water view over there. So this view has been amazing. I wish we were staying here for like the rest of the trip. It's so cool. below here really so this, this will all be grass and public space grass and parks and no vehicles no way wow so is this thing they're making right now will be yeah so all these pilings are putting in the ground yeah these are going to support the landscape that is going to be above what it's That's like it's so like when you think cool. about it it's like oh, really so this hotel we're at is so freaking cool i love that light the design is just so cool it was built in the 20s and now it's still in use with like some cool modern touches i love it Space Needle after this is the second time trying and it's right up there. We're going up. And we're gonna head on up at 10 miles per hour. 
forward. Why do the elevators run so fast, you might ask? Because they work on a pulley system powered by gerbils. That's why the ride's so smooth. Out in front, we have the Puget Sound, named after the second lieutenant that surveyed that area for the British Army. It's about 2,000 feet deep. You might be able to see some orca whales popping out of the water if you take a ferry boat or an orca whale excursion during the summer months. All right, everyone, here we are at the top. Make sure to keep your mask on while you're indoors. And have fun, everyone. Hello. You can just see a whole lake. <laughs> so that's where we parked our car. This guy looks so sad. So dynamic right now, like with the reflection. Mm -hmm. so everyone wouldn't be like moving around trying to get to every side. I think the restaurant. It does. The restaurant spins. There's a restaurant in here? Yeah. Good morning! It is Wednesday, it's the day before Thanksgiving, and we decided to stay an extra night in Seattle, so we rebooked the room again. And now we're going to a cafe for some breakfast and some drinks. This telephone pole is crazy. Like it's, everybody stacked their posters perfectly on top of each other. The course of one afternoon. All the hype, we finally made it to the Spears. Well, I finally made it. Ellie and Cameron have already been here and they're like, you have to go. So we're here. And there's the Space Needle. Pretty walk around cool. Them? Yeah, let's walk around. No. Cam, let's walk this way. because I am yet again eating a sandwich from Starbucks for lunch. But I got another chai. Today's a two, two chai kind of day. And then I got an impossible breakfast sandwich from Starbucks, which I've never tried before, so that'll be interesting. Um, this morning's been super chill, just hanging out with my brother and my sister, walking around to different stores and stuff, and we've had a really great time. I am shocked at how little it's rained since we've been here because you know obviously Seattle rain and it's only rained one time the entire time we've been here so that's really nice so I'm just waiting for my mom to come pick us up she's gonna take us back to my aunt's house then we'll be there for the rest of the week for Thanksgiving we were up at 6 this morning we went to coffee Unless you sit there for three hours, then 